The Storm Citadel could be added near a mountain range where storms are frequent, such as the Adar Mountains in Ebru, or could be placed atop an island near a major coastline or waterway, since Lords of the Storm are typically revered in coastal regions. A storm-shrouded peak amid the Nelantha Isles in the Forgotten Realm setting would be a perfect place to set a citadel full of worshippers of Talos and Umberli who revere the power of the storm. Some storm disciples choose to be part of a hierarchy of a church or priesthood that accepts them. Given the martial nature of storm disciples, these characters always serve the church in a military capacity. Some doctrines do not accept the devotion of a storm disciple, so these disciples are forced outside the hierarchy, where they continue to serve their deity as rogue operatives. Those who have no church affiliation often eschew organizations altogether, choosing a small band of companions to help them proceed in their chosen quests. The most notable organization that includes Storm Disciples is located in the legendary Storm Citadel. The Storm Citadel is a black iron and stone fortress built atop a high peak thrust up into the belly of a permanent flashing thunderstorm. Open parapets and balconies are subject to a constant stream of lightning strikes, howling winds, drenching rains, icy hail, and deafening thunder. Inside the many-roomed fortress, the elements are muted, but the shaking thunder, reflected flashes of exterior lightning, and strong, cool breezes find their way into every chamber. The Storm Citadel's reputation isn't sterling, however, it is whispered among those who know of it that those who reside there have completely severed their ties with their former deity, if they ever had one in the first place, and instead worship only the howling madness of the thunderstorm. Despite what these stories describe, however, those who live in the Storm Citadel are not required to give up any previous affiliation or belief. All that is required is an ability to appreciate and survive the wild fury of a thunderstorm. The Storm Citadel is under the authority of a storm disciple called White Mary, who is happy to let anyone come and stay who can survive the ascent to the fortress. Those who wish to become affiliated with the Storm Citadel gain some advantages of being a part of an organization, including contacts, inside information, a place to stay, and the camaraderie of fellow storm addicts. Storm Disciples who aspire to join also agree to take on tasks assigned by Storm Citadel Elders from time to time.